on this day of independence i will like to thank my forces because of them we can sleep in the night in a peaceful and prosper climate every word is less to thank their sacrifice but still i am sharing my speech to thank them a little bit from the stubborn desert of rajasthan to the counter icy height of siachen from the battling wars to the nation building from scaling mountains to olympic drawing from enduring struggle to supreme sacrifice with an undaunted and indomitable zeal on this day of independence i will like to thank my forces because of them we can sleep in the night in a peaceful and prosperous climate every word is less to thank their sacrifice but still i am sharing my speech to thank them a little bit from the stubborn desert of rajasthan to the counter icy height of siachen from the battling wars to the nation building from scaling mountains to olympic drawing from enduring struggle to supreme sacrifice with an undaunted and indomitable zeal our soldiers lay down their lives for honor for india indian army is the pride of our nation the indian soldier had an illustration march through history from the battlefields of the first world war where 1.3 million soldier marched for value to the second world war where 2.5 million soldier of india fought shoulder to shoulder with the elite forces to uphold the ideals of freedom liberty and democracy as our great nation took the first step towards freedom in 1947 it was the indian army with the secular credentials stood its bulk work to protect human values a quality that returned to its day with sheer grit and determination dismantled tanks and physically pushed them to the 11500 feet high zozila pass this ossidiousness preservance and flawless executions by the indian soldier altered the course of indian's destiny the ill equipped indian soldier stood with an undaunted zeal on his ground willing to lay down their lives even in the face of overwhelming odds they are very much clinical in their approach and this gave us the shy of relief to live peacefully in the country they are the silent protectors who gave up their life silently while the civilians are enjoying their days unknown of the roaming danger around them our indian army has the second largest army in the world after china the formidable reputation of our army goes far beyond of shores in heat and cold in pleasure and pain the indian soldier always ready to sacrifice his life for the dignity of our nation the ethos and spirit of the indian soldier makes the indian army pride of our nation and is evident from the line when you go home tell them of us and say for their tomorrow we gave our today